Every single one of you has a destiny. Every single one of you has a path forward. You're gonna hit obstacles, get around it, have hope. Look at what you went through, break that chain. That is what qualifies you to touch people's lives and go out there and touch it. It's about to get crazy. It's about to go down. It's about to get crazy right now for real. 2010, just went through 2008, went from zero money up to over a million dollars a month, 55 employees, built a crazy empire, had contracts going out to 2017, hundred million dollars worth. And in a single day, everything just started crumbling and I walked through the craziest time of my life. I just laid off 40 of my 55 employees. I lost my cars, I lost the house that I had purchased for my family, lost everything. My bank account was in the negative and I had creditors from all angles coming and tormenting me. You know, I would go out to this bridge, the Forest Hill Bridge, and I would pray on that bridge. And I'd be like, Lord, save my company, Lord. I'll dedicate my life. I'll do all of these different things, Lord. Like getting on my knees on that bridge, basically just crying out. You know, I had no options. I had millions of dollars of debt. I was negative and all the work was gone. I had outcompeted many in the industry to win those contracts. I built an incredible shop and yet it didn't matter what I did and what my team did because the entire economy was falling, right? The banking industry, the housing market, all of it was crumbling. And all the manufacturers around the world that gave job shops like mine work, everybody just pulled back. You guys know the story. It was literally the craziest time that any of us had ever seen. Every single lunch, I would go to that bridge. I would stay on that bridge. I had no way out. I had no options. It was an impossible mountain to get over. Looking at the future, there is no future because I could not see through that wall. I could not see what my destiny was. And yet, just a few days ago, we put out a video risking it all to go to the next level. We have a new addition to our facility. You guys already know, we came from California and we came to Texas, then we went big. But guess what, now it's twice, twice as, as big. big. Oh man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Times have changed. It's been 11 years since I was on that bridge with no hope. And I thought, you know what, since we just had that video and everybody was reacting to the video, I think it's important to come back and actually talk about what's really going on here. Because life is hard. It will hit you in the face over and over. You will fall into valleys. You will go through tremendous circumstances. But I have to tell you, there is always hope at the end of the tunnel. When I was on that bridge, if somebody could have just came to me and said, you know what, Titan, you're agonizing now and you can't see through that wall, but I'm here to tell you, you're gonna rebuild your shop, you're going to rehire employees, you're going to go into education, you're going to build an incredible platform that's gonna help raise skill levels for people all around the world. You know what, Titan? You're gonna actually have twin babies in less than two years. Like, that is an impossible thing. It's an impossible thing, and yet it happened. Hey, you know what, Titan? You used to be in prison. You had tasted this before, but now you're tasting it differently because you have responsibilities that you never had before. But guess what? You did go to prison. Because of that, you are qualified. Because of manufacturing and all that you've done in manufacturing, because of this entire experience right here, you're being given a voice, a bold voice, and you're gonna go back into prisons, not as an inmate, but as a teacher, and you're gonna mentor men, and you're gonna speak to them in a way that other people can't speak because you used to be where they're at. Most people that come out of a situation like I did, they can barely even get a job, right? And now I'm partnering with the biggest companies. And then there's Texas, right? I'm on a bridge. I got no money. I got creditors. I'm losing everything. And if somebody could have just said, you know what, Titan, you're going to move your entire company to Texas. You're going to have an amazing facility. And that facility is going to be a beacon of hope for the entire 
industry and it's just gonna explode. Now wrap your head around that. You guys know, like I'm an extremely humble person, but I understand the platform and I understand the industry and I understand what shop owners are going through. I understand what the industry is going through. That's why I rise up and that's why I fight and that's why we're building the craziest team, bringing in new technologies and risking everything for greatness. And yet I can only stand here with the confidence that I have because of the journey that I've taken I stand here and I'm expanding into the other side of our building. I'm incredibly excited about it and I'm so confident in it because you know what? I've looked at the struggles, I've looked at the mistakes. I have the years of experience to see what I did wrong, what I did right. I look at the problems that I solve and then I look at the platform that we put in place. And I see that there is no competition. Nobody's ever stepped up like we have to do what we're about to do. And I have so much confidence in that, so I know it's gonna work. Why am I telling you all this? You've heard a lot of this through different videos. I'm telling you this because a lot of you guys out there are struggling. A lot of you are hitting that wall right now. Some of you are coming out of prison. Some of you are coming out of marriages. Some of you have just crazy things happening in your lives. But I'm here to tell you that there is always hope. There is always a destiny for your life and that things will get better. But you need to stand up. You need to look back at what happened. You need to break that chain, concentrate on the future and understand that what you went through does not define you. What you went through is not going to be an anchor that holds you down. Instead, it is what qualifies you to serve other people. It's what qualifies you to speak boldly about something that many cannot because they haven't walked in your shoes. So you can look at it as a negative or you can look at it as a positive. Now, one thing that I've learned in life is that I can have all the self gratification. I can, I can, I can lift myself up. I can do all this, right? But it doesn't bring happiness. It doesn't do anything for my life. Serving and teaching other individuals, going into prisons and speaking life into people, going into schools, going to big manufacturing conventions and speaking life into our industry. That is what truly makes me happy. And when I'm serving others, I feel fulfilled. And I truly believe that is the meaning of our lives right now. Every single one of you has a destiny. Every single one of you has a path forward. You're going to hit obstacles. But as I said, get around it, have hope, look at what you went through, break that chain. That is what qualifies you to touch people's lives. This building, this expansion right here, it's monumental. It is huge. I'm doing it in front of the world, but I do it boldly because I got crazy belief. I know I've solved the right problems and I believe in our industry and our industry needs the awareness that we're going to bring, the education that we're going to bring. Our industry needs our platform. I truly believe that and I'm thankful for being in community with you. Now I just want to say something. If you're going through crazy struggles right now and you want to talk to me, go in the comments and start writing because I'm actually going to dedicate time on this video as I do always, but I'm gonna dedicate time. I'm gonna go into the comments and we're gonna talk. And as we talk about what you're going through, many others will see that and you'll be touching other people's lives. Boom, I love you guys. I love this industry. And if you love what we're doing, please hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. As I said, comments, baby, let's go right now. Boom.